Hey guys, Willpower64 here, bringing you all back to another part of The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last part, we explored a little bit of the mountain area and a little bit, well, a lot of Great Bay because we continued off with the Deku uh, title deed trade and we also entered the spider house at Great Bay, which reward us with. I'm gonna show this off real quick. That's the bomb bag. Oh, it's not. Am I not? It's not gonna show it, is it? Oh, it's not gonna show it. Well, at the bottom of our screen, we now have a red rupee, indicating we now have the giant's wallet, which you only get on day one at the spider house over in the Great Bay area. So that is awesome. Now that we have that. And now, I'm gonna talk to this guy here. Stop right there. Do you have some Aaron in the canyon? It's too dangerous outside. I can't allow a sword. That's right. We have a sword. We're allowed to go through. But actually, before we do that. I'm going to be safe than sorry. I'm going to equip another 100 rupees. I want to have 200 rupees in total. I'd rather be safe than sorry. And no, I don't want to save my game. I think that happened to me last time I did this. No, we're not saving. Thank you. Like every time, it's like I try to roll into a ball. It's like, oh, you want to save? It's like, no. All right. We want to talk to this person. For we want to withdraw... 100 rupees. We want 200 in total. How much? So now we can actually take out 500 rupees if we want to. Alright, we have 894 rupees. Cool. No, we don't want to talk to you. I, every time I want to roll into a ball, that always happens. No. No, no I don't want to talk to you! Go away! There we go. Curl into a ball. Let's go. Let's get out of here. I want to roll. We're going to roll out. Yeah, doggy, you're not happy with me. But that's okay, because I just want to go to the east. I want to go to the east. To the east we go. See ya. Alright, here we go. Now we're here, heading to the east. Going over towards those giant towers, or like termite mountains by the looks of it. We also want Epona. I never actually heard Epona song with the Goron drums, actually, so that's kind of cool. All right, and we want to be human for this. We're pretty much gonna be chilling in this area for a good chunk of the time. So, we got Epona. Off we go. So, instead of going to the graveyard, we will be going there very soon. We'll be going there once nighttime hits. But what I really want to do is we're going to turn face this way, ignore the bomb chew for now. And, come on, Epona. I want to go up here. I want to get up this ledge. So, we're going to face this way. Ignore the bomb juice, and we just want to run. There we go. All right. I want to hop off now. And what we want to do, walk forward. Hehehe. <laughs> what are you doing at a place like this? Ikana Hill beyond this point is a place where spirits with troubles and lingering regrets wander. Even now, the spirits wander in search for the one who can save them. It's unfortunate, but it is no place for someone such as you. But if you enter, then you must obtain the mass containing wandering spirits that can be found near the ranch. Without that mask, you can't save their souls. Until then, I will not let you pass by. <laughs> Alright, so we need a mask given by the ranch. And no, it is not the Romani's mask. No, it is this one, the Garo's mask. The, na the mask that can summon hidden Garo ninjas, wear it with C. So, we wear it. Hee hee hee, that's a nice mask you're wearing. That is the mask of the leader of the ninjas who once spied on the hilltop castle with the bloodstained history. With that, you may be able to call out their spirits that even now are still wondering. Perhaps you may be able to save their souls that beyond that wander beyond here. <laughs> a tree appeared. He summoned a tree. Love it. All right, we want the hook shot, and you want to aim for that tree. Aim for the tree. There we go. All righty, and now we are going to wander forward. And hello, what are you? What is that? That is a... 
Need you run? Don't get too close to it. Sniff, sniff. It smells like gunpowder. Put up my shield. It ain't gonna do anything to this thing. Oh, hi, boulder. Where are that boulders? Where are these boulders coming from? Oh, hi. There's a lot of these things. A lot of these guys. Let's just, uh... I'm gonna equip my bunny hood so I can get out of here faster. Bunny hood, let's roll. Bunny hood, go, go, go. Let's get out of here before it's too late. Ikanya Canyon. This is the area we wanted to go to. But, a uh, hi. What are you doing here? Hey, hey. Hey, that's a nice sword you have. Hehe. <laughs> you know, lately, frightened ghosts have been appearing in the swamps in the kind of canyon across the river. It seems that the ghosts of the royal, f the ghosts of Ikana's royal family, or something. There's no one living here anymore, so I moved nearby. Hehe. <laughs> now there's only, only a curious parent and child living in there while they do research the ghosts. Did I mention this? That is one nice sword. Can I see it for a second? No, thank you. Oh, fine. Yeah, we don't trust this guy. This guy you don't want to go near. However, if you come over here. Master, you called. What are you? Yeah, you summon someone. It said that that's a Garo. Just concentrate on blocking and dodging those sharp swords. Just like that. Boom, he's down. That was easy. Regrettable. Although my rival, you were spectacular. I shall take my bow by opening my heart and revealing my wisdom. To cross the Valley of Akana, aim at the River of Beasts with the arrowhead that freezes. Belief or disbelief rests with you. To die without leaving a corpse, that is the way of us Garrows. And he's gone. All right. Where we want to go to real quick is over here. For over here, go all the way over here. We got ourselves another Goron. Or not Goron, sorry. Another Deku Scrub. So we want to be a Zora for this. Actually, no. We want to be human first. Be human. Talk to him. Thanks for stopping by. I'm doing business here in the canyon. You should give up going to the far side of the canyon. That place is cursed. If you don't have something that drives away demons, they'll catch you. Rumor ham demons are afraid unless they see something that looks the same as themselves. Don't you need any blue potion in case you get cursed? One drink is 100 rupees. Okay, so it was 100 rupees in the end. Okay, so we didn't really need to take out 100 rupees, but that's fine. We got ourselves a blue potion. Now, this blue potion is going to be needed for something very important, so make sure you have that. In the meantime, it will be stored in your bottle so you can take it with you. Thanks again. Drink it right away if you're cursed. Now, we want to be a Zora because... Talk to him. Thanks for stopping by. You're from the ocean, aren't you? I'm here to sell blue potions. Actually, I want to do business in the sea breeze while listening to the sound of the waves. Just stay away from Lulu's place, okay? Do you know what we mean through the proper channels? Well, of course we do. As a matter of fact, here you go. That is the last one here oh if it isn't the ocean of deed let me have that please if you have it my dreams will come true i'm not asking for it for free i'll give you this you got a huge rupee this is worth 20 two another 20 no 200 rupees that's a big deal oh yeah the nut brown beauties are waiting the what i am sorry the what What did he just say was waiting for him? All right, well, in that case, um, yeah, we actually have an open C button slot. Let's put a Deku Scrub there. All right. With the power of the Deku, we're going over here. I'm gonna hop down, and we got ourselves a piece of heart for it. Now, uh, before we go back being go back to where we need to go to, we want to equip this, and let's see what this says to us. This gossip stone. Let's see here. The mystical stone responds to the mass and speaks to you. 
but his words are heard in secret. The Fierce Deity Mask, a mask that contains the merits of all the masks, seems to be somewhere in this world. So a special mask, the Fierce Deity Mask, is somewhere in this world, wherever that might be. Not sure where it could be, but hey, good to know that there's a special mask somewhere around here. All right. No more of the the land title stuff now. That is all done and done with. So will you get yourself a decent number of pieces of heart just by doing that. So that's awesome. So where we want to go to now, we're going to ignore that guy. And where we want to go to is over here. You want to equip your ice arrows. And. Jerks. Freeze that one. And. Uh, did we freeze the other one? Uh, does not look like we did. Ah, we really didn't get him. Alright, let's try that again. Oh, there's another uh, mask there. Okay. Well, let's see. Freeze him. And hopefully we get here on time before this defreezes or un or melts or yeah it starts to there you go it just starts to unmelt itself but there we go now with our hook shot we want to get a hold of this tree here and then uh where is there's the other tree grab this one here and then the last one is this one right here cool and, of course, we have another owl statue. When was the last time we saw one of these? All right, so we have a way of getting back here. But before we actually explore this area, I want to equip the Zora mask, become a Zora, and we're going to go for a swim. Yeah, we want to go over here. For over here, I think this is the... Actually, no, it's not. Oh, we have to go back up there. <laughs> no, this is the, uh, the wrong place I wanted to go to. This was not the place I wanted to be. Now waiting the challenges of bold visitors. Yeah, no, this wasn't the area we wanted to go to. So I'm going to re-equip my ocarina. And we're going to go back up to that area we just were. So I was thinking this was the area we had to go to. This is something we had to go to after uh, an important spot. All right. Let's uh, leave this section. And pretty much, there's a house we want to go to somewhere up here. And while we're up here, we can probably go see, um, what's his name? We can probably go see, uh, Tingle and get a map for this place. So let's get our bunny hood up. And let's go find that house. Now, we got some enemies around here. I'm not going to go over this area just yet. I want to come back when I'm ready to explore this area. Then we'll deal with this area. But first things first, Tingle, come on down. Thank you. All right, let's go say hi to Tingle. What's this? Green clothes? White fairy? Could you be chance to be a forest fairy? Indeed we are. All right. So, we're gonna get ourselves a map of this place and we're gonna find that thing we were looking for. We pretty much want to, we want to get back to Clock Town before 11 o'clock. Here we go, we got the map of Stone Tower. So this is the area. This is Ikana Canyon, a.k.a. Stone Tower. And don't steal them. But what if I already said them? What are you going to do about it, Tangle? Nothing. That's what you're going to do about it. All right. This was the house I wanted to go to. This house right here. Spirit's house. We prepare wandering spirits when they await your arrival. Let's go in and say hi. Hello. Hehehe, <laughs> Ikana Kingdom was founded on this land, stained with the history of darkness, drenched in blood. And even now it is a place where troubled, regretful spirits gather. If you are seeking the one who is stronger than you are, you may find strength here. From a group of spirits plagued by lingering regrets. If you have the faith in your skills and might, then try and save these wandering spirits. <laughs> But the earthly price you must pay is 30 rupees. Will you still do it? Sure. You are a boy of much vigor. 
Defeat the ladies within the time limit and restore their souls in peace. But if your life energy drops below three hearts, I will stop the match. Mercy is the least I can offer. Are you prepared? We are. Let's do this. First thing, we got this ghost here. These, this might look familiar, as these are some of the, those enemies that were back in, um... Uh, what was it? Uh, Ocarina of Time. They were in the forest temple. Yeah, one jump slash is enough to take them out. And now you gotta deal with two of them. Ow. Okay, let's just focus one at, with one at a time. Let's see here. Alright. Ah, I wasn't close enough. Can I target one of them, please? Ah, dang it. Come on. Okay, they're gonna disappear. Keep an eye on that one. Wait for it to reappear, but stay away from that one. Ah, dang it. Okay, I think uh, my bow is gonna be my best friend for this one. For this part here. There you go. Yeah. Looks like my bow is going to be my best friend. I'll wait till once I take this one out, then we'll be okay. So wait for it to appear. Wow. <laughs> How many arrow shots is it going to take? Come yeah, on. I always find this part to be the hardest part of the match. There we go. Ah, dang it. Okay. There you go. Is it going to reappear, or do I gotta wait for a full attack? Or a full spin? Looks like it. There we go! Now this part is gonna require the bow. Because... This one appears. And then... You wanna aim for the one that was spinning. Like that one. Okay, where is it now? Yeah, you gotta use your arrow for this. Okay, there we go. I also I like how the timer stops for this. Like the actual, the map actually doesn't. Uh, uh oh. Uh oh. Ah, dang it. All right, come on. I'm actually having a hard time with this. Okay, we only got a couple of seconds left. There we go. Okay. Hopefully, next shot we'll get it. Let's see. Once it appears. Okay, it was, uh, nope. It was that one. There we go. Just in the nick of time, too. Okay, that was pretty close. That was closer than I was hoping for. It seems their souls have been healed. I give it to you, the earthly possession which which in the ladies kept. Take it, Link. And there we go. We got ourselves a piece of heart for our troubles. Very nice. Alright. That is your name, correct? I can read people's hearts. I knew you'd be coming. Now... Now, with my soul, have been healed too. With that, <laughs> and they slowly vanish. Interesting. All right. Before we head over to Clock Town, I want to go over to the graveyard. For the graveyard has something for us on day one, so we want to do that. And yes, there is something appearing here at night, but we're not going to worry about that yet. Because it's just another one of those Garrows that you can fight who will actually give you information about this place. But I'm not too concerned about the information about this place. I'm more interested in going into the graveyard. Because you need to go to the graveyard on night one. You'll get something very important there. So instead of boulders falling around here, you got these guys. Which, I don't want to deal with any of these guys right now. So we're just going to ignore these guys and just get past them. However, those guys are going to be pretty helpful later on. Trust me. Alright, um... We want the captain's mask. Before this. Uh-oh. 
Okay, stay away. Uh, never mind. I just ran right into him instead. <laughs> I was like, stay away from him. Stay. And uh, never mind. I smacked right into him. All right. You got enemies around here. I like that guy. Look at him. This guy's just swinging it around. That's cute. All right. Uh, we want to talk to this. Uh, we want to talk to one of these guys. Hello. Huh? Ah, Captain, sir. Excuse me, sir. Everyone, give the captain your attention. We, have, we haven't seen you in a while, Captain, sir. As for your order, sir, we are guarding these greys closely. We have all been expecting your next order, sir. What shall we do? We want to open the grave, please. Uh, open it? Yes, sir. Everyone, follow me. Open the grave. Cool. In the go. And down we go. So hopefully we're not cursed down here. Are we? We are still cursed. I could use that blue potion, but I'm not going to. Because I want to keep that blue potion. And now we got a problem. Oh, I'm not cursed anymore. Okay. Just use your spin attack on all these guys and just take them out. Take out all these bats. Because if you do, you get a special reward for it. Alright, it should be... There we go. That's the last one. Cool. Alright. We got a little reward for that. So let's open this up. And what do we get? We got ourselves a purple rupee for that. So that's pretty cool. But what we want to do... Is I want magic. I got arrows instead. So hopefully... We want to... Equip our fire arrows. And we want to light that. Light that one. And there should be one more right above us. Oh no, it's right here. There we go. There we go. Got all of them lit up. That's what we wanted. Now, in here, be prepared. What you want to do is pull out your sword, do an attack. We got this thing. You know about the Iron Knuckle, right? Stay away from its axe attack. It looks for a chance to retaliate. Yeah, this guy does a l This enemy does a lot of damage. This was also another enemy back in Ocarina Time. This does a lot of damage. Once its armor is off, it moves faster as it would. Wait for an attack, and then attack. And there you go, it's down. Not that hard. But there you go. Iron Knuckle is down. But now for the real thing. Are you the one who freed my soul? I serve the Ikana royal family. I am the composer called Flat. The songs commended to the royal family that remains here were all the composed by my brother and I. Oh, Sharp, my dear brother. He sold his soul to the devil and was the one who locked me in here. You who do not fear the dead, learn well the song that I inscribe behind me. And if you ever meet my brother, I'd like you to inform him. The thousand years of raindrops summoned by my song are my tears. The thunder that strikes the earth is my anger. I have made my request. Let's check it out. The thousand years of raindrops summoned by my song are my tears. And the thunder that strikes the earth is my anger. Here is written the song that shall cleanse his curse, Black Soul. You remember the Song of Storms. This melody that you've heard before is the turbulent tune that blows curses away. So yeah, if you are now cursed, if you get uh, jinxed by one of those enemies that turns you all blue, 
you can now just go back to normal now, which is awesome. All right. Well, that's pretty much it for this area. We are going to be pretty much heading back to Clock Town. But I think that's going to be safe for the next part. So the next time on The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, we head over to Clock Town, take care of a few things there, and begin our quest in Ikana Canyon. I will see you guys then.